Mobile technology has made many things more accessible, from text messaging to FaceTiming. But one thing it's brought about is less desirable and may require some visits to the chiropractor in our near future. We see the rolled shoulders and the people with their head forward over their shoulders as well. The condition that she's talking about is referred to as text neck. And it's made news recently after a study was published in the Surgical Technology International Journal. The gist of the study is that, spoiler alert, the weight seen by the spine dramatically increases when flexing the head forward at varying degrees. The head weighs about 8 to 10, 12 pounds, and so the farther forward that it comes over the shoulder, the more stress that it puts on the spine and also on the muscles and the neck and also in the upper back. You might be asking, and if you're not, you probably should be, what is the effect of this forward position? So it's a tremendous amount of extra pressure on the nerves and the disc in the spine too as that head starts to come forward. And then of course the shoulders start to roll forward as well. Who knew all that time staring down at our electronics could have such an undesired physical effect? We should have a forward curvature, so every time we start to look down, we're reversing that curvature, making that worse. And again, pressure on the nerves, pressure on the discs in between. It's doubtful any of us will be willing to lay off our phones or mobile devices anytime soon. So what other options do we have to prevent this forward neck position? Any kind of exercises that we can do to bring the shoulders, so upper back exercises, any uh, motions that bring the shoulders back, the head back. Um, also, we can have patients lie on, their, on the floor or on the bed, roll up a, a towel into a cervical bolster, if you will, to help support the neck and bring that neck into its forward posture. Also, chiropractic adjustments are recommended to realign the spine as well. As far as our texting habit... I always joke with people, I'm like, hold your phone up, hold it um, where it's straight in front of you, or, you know, if your kids um, have them lie on their bed or put their head, hang their head over their bed to help increase that forward curvature too. Um, and I know it sounds funny, but that's really the best way to, to text is to have it up forward in front of you. While it may look a little silly, it's better than the alternative of a neck jutting out from our spine. I'm Joey Panic, and that's what's up.